If the greatest trade in history. The greatest trade of all time. Someone bought $8,000 into Shiba Inu. Shiba Inu. Shiba Inu. Shiba. What is the best investment of all time? Because apparently someone bought $8,000 worth of Shiba in August of last year, which is now apparently worth $5.7 billion. The meme that broke the internet. But you're rich, so who cares? lightsaber back with another squid grow video guys we're gonna do an update on this the price has been moving since my last video okay guys um it was pulling back we've been in a long pullback over here we're on the four hour chart by the way but now we're seeing that volume coming in we're seeing some big green candles that's what we want to see positive price action i do believe that it's going to go sideways for a little bit longer but for me the longer that it goes sideways the better for one, you get to accumulate more tokens. And for two, the longer the accumulation, the bigger the move to the upside. An example is over here, right? You see this big accumulation. If we just zoom in, actually, right? We see this long accumulation. We are on a four hour chart, but the longer that it accumulates, once it does finally take off, you see the size of that move right there is pretty massive, All right, guys? And I expect to see the same thing on this next leg. Potentially, it doesn't have to happen. But that's normally how these things play out. This is currently under 100 million market cap. It's super micro cap, 20 million. And of course, I believe that this is going into the multiples of billions. They're going to be bridging this over to Ethereum. And from what I've heard is that Shiptoshi is going to be matching the liquidity over on Ethereum as well, guys. Remember, every transaction that takes place on this, um, there is a portion of the fees going to marketing. Uh, sorry, not to marketing, going to liquidity. The marketing is coming out of Shiptoshi's pocket himself. If you don't know who Shiptoshi is, I do recommend that you go and watch this recent video by Bad Anthony. Uh, Shiptoshi is the founder of Squid Girl, and he turned $8,000 into 5.7 billion dollars which is said to be the best trade ever in history right it gives you a little bit about his background and how he got into crypto why he started squid grow and so on so i do recommend you go and check out that video by bad anthony his content is very good as well i will say that very high quality go and check that out and you'll be able to hear from the man himself who created it not bad anthony he didn't create it he's just an influencer but um, the person that created it is Shiptoshi, and he is, um, you know, on a phone call on this video. You can go and check that out. All right, guys. Now, another thing to note is that we are on several exchanges, which we've looked at in previous videos, some of which are not listed on here. We have MEXC, LBank, PancakeSwap, of course, BitTrue, BitMark, CoinTiger, BKEX, Big One, and Dcoin. And the most recent listing that I've seen on Twitter is Gate.io. So in previous videos, I talked about the fact that Gay.io had been tweeting several tweets about Squid Grow, asking about Squid Grow, and it looks like now, this was nine hours ago, right? It looks like now they're going to be listing Squid Grow, and they're having an event between August the 25th and August the 26th, where you can participate. If you come over on Twitter, you can click on the link and you can participate in the event for the free offering on Squid Grow. Um, there's an airdrop value of 150k eligibility for all kyc users so that's just going to bring more holders into squid grow and more volume of course once people start trading on gate.io which is a pretty good exchange all right guys so squid grow another exchange i reckon we're going to see it list on so many more exchanges some people are talking about binance coinbase i can't see that for a long time but you know lower tier exchanges like qcoin for example um huobi maybe you know, things like that. I think we're going to see a lot more listings of Squid Girl. That would definitely be very nice to see. All right, guys. Also, you'll find that the staking rewards have been lowered. They did put an announcement out about this. Uh, the reason being is that, of course, um, there's, there was a lot of selling pressure coming from um, the high staking rewards and LP farming rewards uh, before the LP was at 500% rewards and the staking was at 50% rewards. It's now at 20% and of course the LP is at 100% as you've seen. So uh, that's less selling pressure. All right, people are using it as a passive income, which it is, and selling their rewards. So if you're a huge bag holder and you're selling rewards on the way down, that's causing extra 
unnecessary pressure on the token. So of course, you know, the DGEN rewards are always good at the start. It attracts a lot of users, but in, for, for in the long run, it's only going to hurt the project. So right now they've lowered the staking rewards and LP farming rewards, which makes it more bullish. All right, guys, less selling pressure and more potential growth to the upside. So when the buy pressure comes in, it's not getting offset by that selling pressure that's dragging it down all right guys so we are seeing it move to the upside very very bullish and you know of course you can still get a decent reward okay guys depending on the size of your bag you know you may still want to stake in here for the 20 percent of course you can see i am still staking haven't had to do anything with it just left it in there and it just rolls over now it's paying out 20 percent instead of 50 percent but i'm still happy i'm getting additional tokens all right guys and what i can do is harvest those add it back into the contract and kind of compound that manually if i want to but i'm just leaving it just to accumulate it's not a huge amount right guys but you know it's pretty decent okay guys so uh yeah as you can see there are um this one wasn't listed on coin market cap reflex which is another exchange i'm not sure if l bank was on there also Oh yeah, L Bank is on there. Okay, but we have the Reflex Exchange as well, which is a decentralized exchange, I believe. So yeah, that's uh, 11 exchanges so far. Um, and more to come, I would assume. Okay, guys. So yeah, I just wanted to give you that update. Price is looking bullish. Um, I never recommend FOMOing in. All right, guys, you want to be accumulating down here. Once these moves come, it's more than likely it's going to have a pullback, especially when it reaches support or resistance. Sorry, as you can see, it did reach a little bit of resistance and it's having a bit of a pullback. If it does go straight up, happy days. All right, guys, but a long accumulation will still be super bullish for this project, even if it pulls back, goes sideways for a bit. Right, that is definitely a time to be accumulating. But, of course, I have to say it's not financial advice. Do your own research. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. I am super bullish on Squid Grow in the long term. And um, if you do watch this video, it will probably make you even a little bit more bullish uh, or just as bullish as I am on this particular token. So, let me know what you think in the comments. Do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.